had a go and it got in the game and I'm sorry there haven't been any content for a while but um, and I would explain in a uh, brand new channel that it can time but it coming soon um, you will know why I'm gonna a little less on it um, um, on it less but today we want to talk about today we want to talk about Predation and Sony not coming to E3 2019. Now Predation and Sony had dropped out of E3 2019 for two years in a row, two years in a row, or two years back to back, and it's so all woody. Especially did you? why the console war especially the year where it the when it going into when it go especially the year when the year in a console war and it is really big because they did can change gaming forever i know they say it all the time but did it between the if you had a line between console and p between dedicated console and dedicated PC gaming, this generation is on the line. This generation just separate them two devices by a line. The console is literally becoming like a PC, like we, like we almost saw it. It literally becoming. It literally becoming like a PC. Um, the new Xbox Series X look like a PC tanner. That how big it look like, and that how PC ready. The Xbox also got all. The Xbox is also doing PC like thing, like building it own custom controller, and also doing PC like thing. We're not back with compatibility. But backward compatibility with all for media content like game and that salary. The that spot is becoming like a PC. So yeah. What did Sony say? Well Sony basically said they don't think E3 right for what they have to show off um for what they had to show off, but might have saw a sort of came back to that and so we'll be attending the show um like we had to do like they do any year and we're excited to and then even more thing about even more thing what Teen X spot had in store and when you think of the three it's all sort of leave it's all sort of getting ruined like i know people what i gone because it's too packed because the ELA had opened to the budget. Edison Nintendo led the show for and start doing a big sort of presentation direct. It being so might as well not on the E feature for the show sort of They're just sort of standing there on the side saying, Oh, we're, we're part of the three, but we're actually not. We're just, um, we're just on the side. Um, so they're not really... We're just on the side, so they're not really... Um, they're not really there at the convention center. at the convention center they're not really there at the convention center they're not really there at the convention center um so yeah e3 has sort of been rude and i wonder that e3 another thing e3 has sort of been ruined edison it opened to a project i know some 
gaming content creator gone to free edits in the year and they said it just been ruined by um it just been ruined it just been ruined uh, by the game by the um by the entertainment software open to the budget and open to the budget and that why it also um by um the ent bay bay is a rate game and it also about that company they are the same company what defend loot bots what defend loot bots in the micro transaction they're the same company what defend pay to win mechanic they're the f same company what with what in the crisis what gamer were fighting against greedy pudger like EA Activision and Ubisoft they were just stand there and say nothing and at the end when at the end when gamer from the gaming community and and pudger for pudger community all they did is put a logo with they said in game purchase it didn't say whether it was loot boxes, whether it was a battle pad, a DLC, a expansion, a story mode, a story mode. It just... It just made it sad. Here, the game have in-game portable item. So that mean new boxes, battle power, monetization, short car, primo and currency, uh, item shot, store, does that mean, uh, or does that mean all three of them, we, we kind of don't know. We kind of don't know, and what do they mean for other company? What do they mean for, um, other comp other company, what, um, don't have the fun or the money or just don't put on their show like at what did what about the other country what Letty free and don't have their show like Activision with Call of Duty um and they team up with Playstation Rockdown for GTA and Red Dead Redemption they don't put on their own show they let and they also They learn and they also put on their own show. They also put on their own show with. They also put on their own show with Predation. What about. What about Bungie with Destiny 3 or a new Destiny expansion? They don't pay for E3. They don't go to E3. They go with Predation. What about all the company what go with prey what go to e fee but go with prey Asian and that are doing their cons? What the releasing GTA 6 Call of Duty releasing the net Call of Duty game in Destiny with Destiny 3? What does that mean in the future? Well, we don't know. And this sort of kind of confirmed. That E3 is dead. Like, I'm sorry, but I think E3, I think E3 might be officially dead. And I think in the next three years, they're not going to be a reason to go to E3 or reason to celebrate E3 or even the even the time because the e3 is not an event you go for it uh, uh it it now becoming a period of time because i expect so i expect the company what are not going to e3 or what are i expect them to like uh i expect they team up with sony and do their own event or their own PNR event, or their own Twitter live stream, or social media, or their own in game event, even if it does not appeal, 50% of all bidders, or maybe, um, 
fifty percent of all budgeted or the complete Dagony collection for something like sixty pa. For something like sixty pa. So I imagine other companies would go along. I imagine company would do this. But what is really the point of these things now? Are these three the thing that we need to celebrate? Or were these three a massive thing? Like, E3, what was the sea at a gaming where any game, any person in the industry, whether you're a content creator, a game, a game developer, Um, bef um, it'll probably be a long video. The important E3 guy. This is the next where console are gonna become more, are gonna become a part of it. They got, we're talking 8K, sit the up here. We're talking 4K, sit the up here. Maybe even 8K 13, maybe. Even at 120 up 1440p or or something um or something um and that is really important. We're talking like we're talking like um third time really that console and PC console. Console with a dedicated piece, with a kind of dedicated piece gaming, with a kind of dedicated low end gaming PC. Um, and gaming PC are actually coming closer together because so we're getting like that. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below, and I will see you. Do you think Sony should drop out of the free or not? Do you like it? Do you n not like it? And let me know down below in the comments section. Did it guard in the game? It's signing up.